Welcome Pisces to your monthly reading for January 2018 in love. So happy new year. Um, we're going to see what's going on with you for the month of January 2018 in love. 10 card count across spread. That's what we're going to do for Pisces for January 2018 in love. Um, I do feel like there's a lot of hard work um, for many of you. Um, very busy. You could be working overtime. A lot of different obligations. Many different things. D different tasks that you're doing. Um, something where it's putting in a lot of effort um, with the eight of pentacles that pop out in the beginning of the reading as I was shuffling the card so um, we'll see what's going on message of Pisces for January 2018 and love okay okay so whoa we do have the king of pentacles so that did that was right so a lot of um hard work and dedication a lot of different financial transactions that you are dealing with you could be uh, focused on or are around in uh, capricorn virgo or taurus but i do feel that money is coming in sometimes swiftly and sometimes uh very um happily so you may be liking it so we do have the five of pentacles in reverse so money if you spent a lot of money uh, during the holiday season, maybe throughout the new year, um, something is happening where things are flowing in and you're getting back on your feet. Um, if you are um, trying to reach certain goals, I feel for a lot of you out there, any kind of issues around the home with the five of pentacles in reverse. All right. So you do have the lovers in reverse at the bottom of the um, energy. So there could be issues with you too financially that's going on um, some of you could be dealing with third party situation where you're just not on the same page with your romantic partner there could be three people involved of course with the lovers in reverse so um, sometimes it's infidelity sometimes it's um, just disagreements on how to work through a relationship with your partner the recent past is that regret you know moving on from someone that you felt like the connection was not really there it wasn't working out emotionally not really feeling stable so you felt like there's other things for you you know so you are moving on to that and moving away from it in the recent past some regret there and i feel with judgment here in reverse i feel a lot of you um could be having issues this month with making a choice making a decision um trying to stick to that and logically trying to figure out what you actually want to do so this is being very indecisive about um going a certain way a certain direction all right could be dealing with the Scorpio. Some of you dealing with financial issues, especially if you um, with, was dealing with a, a legal matters and court matters and having to put out money for that and waiting for uh, things to kind of uh, close out. All right. So we do have the King of Wands in reverse in the near future. So some of you may be dealing with an Aries, Leo or Sagittarius, but someone that and this could be your own energy as well when you are talking to different people um, if you are in a relationship with someone or you're dealing with someone who is juggling two different people with the lovers in reverse and I feel like you may understand who this is and what energy this is if you are giving this off or if someone else is giving this off and you're still indecisive about um, that particular person I feel all right now the five of cups is in reverse and this is your energy of forgiving someone who was giving off that energy that's what i get a sense of um if you're dealing with someone who you continue maybe to give a second chance or you continue to forgive that person um or if they forgive you they continuously forgive you and um you're having issues with sticking to a certain choice or a decision so some of you are trying to emotionally move on and heal from something or someone i feel all right now the seven of wands is here how others are seeing you or how your romantic partner is seeing you they see that you are stating your case you're standing up for what you sense what you feel if you're pushing away from someone and someone is kind of coming into your life you're you know stating why things are not um working for you why emotionally you had to walk away from the situation when you feel that there was no balance so here is um, having the courage to do that and state your case and this is how your partner family or friends may be seeing you that you're in the that you have the right of way to kind of state how you feel and you do have these six of cups in the energy of what your partner may be going through or what they may be up to so this could be someone coming from your past or the fact that someone that you are dealing with is dealing with someone from their past with these six of cups here um, that's what I kind of see all right and we have the two of swords in reverse so sometimes coming to a decision about something but often 
being indecisive about a certain decision where you're kind of here you're there you're really not sure because you're in your head about certain things so um, we'll see why the energy is there okay so i'm back i had to pause because the storage was getting a bit low so um let's clarify judgment in reverse for pisces clarify judgment in reverse we have the page of swords so usually some arguments and issues with maybe another aquarius label or gemini and these arguments may be happening over and over again and you go around the same issues over and over again and nothing is being resolved i feel for some of you out there let's see clarify judgment in reverse of pisces again clarify judgment reverse of pisces. and you have these seven of pentacles so usually still waiting around for things to change not really making a move um there are issues with this being either stubborn or someone else is being stubborn and no action is being taken. That's what I get a sense of. Um, clarify the lovers in reverse for uh, Pisces. Clarify the lovers in reverse for Pisces. Clarify the lovers. And you do have the nine of pentacles. So there are issues maybe with money focusing on independence where um, there could have been either you are focusing too much on the relationship and connection where there's an imbalance there. There needs to be a change, I feel. So some of you are either single, you're moving away from someone, or you and your partner is needing space, I feel. All right. Um, clarify the Eight of Cups for Pisces. Clarify the Eight of Cups for Pisces. And you do have the Three of Swords in reverse. So definitely healing from past heartbreak, pain, um, anything that you have been thinking about, that you have experienced with the third person, um, any kind of interference, and you're moving away from that situation, trying your best to do that. All right. Clarify the King of Wands reverse for uh, Pisces. Clarify the King of Wands reverse for Pisces. And you do have the Page of Cups. So I feel like there is a relationship there, but... Um, that person could have been uh, talking to someone else. They could have been in a relationship already. You could have been in a relationship already for some of you out there. Um, it just seems to me that there are a couple people that are involved. Different people are showing up here. You got a one. You got the page. You have a few pages. You have the king. You have two kings as well. So um, it just depends here. So let's clarify the five of cups reverse for Pisces. Let's clarify the five of cups reverse for Pisces. And you do have the Knight of Cups in reverse. So a lot of uh, possessiveness. Um, there could have been issues with delays in communication. A lot of jealousy going on in a relationship. It just depends there. You know, assuming different things. Um, if your partner is kind of possessive of, uh, possessive of you. If you're possessive of them. Um, it just depends there. Alright. Maybe another Pisces, Scorpio or Cancer. Yeah. Clarify the Seven of Wands for Pisces. Clarify the Seven of Wands for Pisces. And we do have the Eight of Wands. So either you're <clears throat> expressing how you feel about certain things or vice versa. And you're not saying anything back or the other person is not saying something back. So I feel like there's a lot of frustration and delays with another person. And it could be resentment. Say if you're in a relationship with someone and there was someone else involved. There could be resentment between you and another person maybe from the past. Um, it just depends with the Page of Cups being there. Let's clarify the Six of Cups for your partner if you're dealing with somebody. Clarify the Six of Cups for Pisces partner. Clarify the Six of Cups. Clarify the Six of Cups. And I feel like it's being indecisive. The Two of Pentacles is here. Indecisive about um, either you in the past. I'm um, holding on to the past. Those are being some things of juggling, I feel, here with the Two of Pentacles. All right. Do I come back to you, especially if you have broken up? Um, do I come back to you or not? Those kind of things are going to clarify the two of swords reverse for uh, Pisces. Clarify the two of swords reverse for Pisces. And you do have the eight of pentacles. So I feel like you're choosing to focus on career. You're choosing to focus on your goals and kind of walking away from certain things. That's what I feel, especially emotionally. And it doesn't seem like to me that there's going to be emotional happiness or bliss that's happening maybe this month. So a lot of you are um, changing your focus and moving away from uh, something that's been very heavy, I feel. All right. So those are your messages for um, for the month. So let's see what's going on with you for uh, January 2018 for Pisces and love. Messages for Pisces for January 2018. 
very soon it says clearly decide what you want so that it comes to you now that's why i feel that this king of wands energy whoever that person may be especially if there's you're indecisive kind of unsure of what to actually do with judgment being here in reverse so you actually really have to ask yourself some questions you know communicate how you're feeling and really um move forward in a certain direction all right i feel for many of you so let's see message of pisces one more card for pisces for january 2018 and we have deception someone is wearing a false self mask in this relationship now to me the deception sometimes it can be mild but it does seem to be um sometimes it's it's severe because someone is not being honest about what's going on and then that leaves you uncertain and unclear about how to you know stick to a certain decision or choice that you want to make so um it does that looks unhealthy to me so that's why i feel like this card is coming through and getting over this energy right here and you don't want to walk back into something that has um, been very toxic so i feel like a lot of you have some reevaluating to do so those are your messages they are general in nature um if you would like a private or personal reading you can go to the website psychiclovehills.com to schedule something that's going to be specifically for your energy all right so have a good one thanks